Time passes minute by minute. Su Lianyue's eyes were closed, and she looked as if she was resting, but her divine soul was running hundreds of millions of trillions every second, fully understanding the mysteries contained in Mad Sword Silence and Eight. Desolations. Soon. First floor. Tenth floor. Thirty floors. Fiftieth floor. Eightieth floor. The one hundred and twentieth floor. Phew, Su. Xianyue exhaled deeply and opened her eyes. In her eyes, the essence flickered, and it seemed to contain an extreme sharpness, and when it burst out, it seemed to be able to sweep away everything under the world. Gongzi, Mercier came for you. Su Lianyue raised her snow white wrist, stroked Su Chang's button, and undid the button. Soon, she stripped Su Chang's upper body naked. Su Changa sat down at the end of the bed, and she sat behind Su Changa, and the snow white jade hand touched Su Changa's back, closed it, and began to transmit the gong with a buzz. Su Changa only felt a vast and matchless breath enter his body, and in a short moment, the vast sea of mysteries rolled in his body, flowed, converged, and finally fell silent and became his own power. This process proceeded very quickly. It didn't take long for Su Changa to understand that it turned out that this knife technique was particular about opening and closing, and the momentum was strong and strong, and it was invincible. It's the kind of thing that doesn't say much is dry, as soon as you cut it. You have to cut out a neat, cut out a horizontal knife, to the sky, domineering. Side leakage. At this moment, he suddenly felt a black in front of him, and a soft and crystalline little hand covered his eyes, and covered the light. Then, a voice sounded, Guess who I am? Huh? Su Changa smiled. The skin collides, like a piece of beautiful jade patches, delicate and soft. Silky and delicate. And, a fragrant woman's fragrance came to the nose. He was also in no hurry to poke, smiled playfully, and said, You guess I. Don't guess. The host is so interesting, it's so funny. A gentle and comfortable voice sounded. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. Then, the palms in front of him moved away, and the light reappeared in front. Of him. A slim figure wearing a colorful veil walked by step and sat on the opposite side. The part behind this figure, with a furry tail, was swinging happily. Xiaoyu, when did you finish precipitating? Su Changa released a smile at her. When that palm was applied to his eyes, he knew it was Xiao Chao. I didn't expect when Xiaoyu learned to be so naughty. Actually, it's already done, but it hasn't come out, he he, the little red lips opened and closed, and the smile was delicate and moving. After the precipitation was completed, her body grew a lot taller, and her willow waist became more and more slender, like a colorful willow. Sensing the master's gaze, a crimson color suddenly flashed on Xiaoyu's face. And he said intermittently, Master, don't. Don't look, as. She spoke, her cheeks became redder, like white clouds in the sky dyed red by. The sun. Su Changa's gaze stayed on her for a long time before moving away. You came out just right, Lianer and I were planning to go to the buried. Sword Villa, if there were you, the speed would definitely be faster. Su Changa looked at Xiaoyu and smiled faintly. As he spoke, he was also thinking that he would not put Xiao Eater in the system space in the future, there was a gray area, as if it was a chaos, Xiao. Feiji would definitely be uncomfortable. Then change the place, the Shanhuang Pagoda of Heaven and Earth is good. Inside is a vast world, flowers, and trees, everything in the world, she will. Definitely like it. Yes, Master. Xiaoyu nodded happily, and the tail behind him swirled happily. 
Soon, the transmission was completed. Su Changa felt that in his mind, the mysterious meaning of Mad Sword. Annihilation and eight wilderness flowed, gushing unceasingly, and majestically. Immediately, the three of them walked out of the house, and Xiao Yu turned into a Tengu form, rose up in the sky, and took Su Changa and the two to break through the air. Along the way, Su Changa briefly explained why he went to Berry Sword Villa. And then summed it up and said, Lear, you are a little older than Xiao Yu. So let's call her sister in the future. Turning his head, he said to Xiao Yu again, Xiao Yu, you can call Lear sister. Hmm. Xiao Yu and Lear nodded one after another. The two of them are about the same age, but if you calculate carefully, Su. Xianyue is slightly older than Xiao Yu. Xiao Yu's speed was fast, carrying the two of them, and he sped towards the Buried Sword Villa. Located in the southern part of the eastern region, Buried Sword Villa is a sword cultivation force, only cultivating swords, and not others. The reason why it is called Buried Sword is a long story, in the middle. Ages, the Buried Sword Villa was originally called the Ziang Sword Field, and Later the palm sect of the Ziang Sword Field was defeated in a competition. Willing to gamble and lose, so he buried his sword, meaning that he would not shoot again, and the golden basin washed his hands, was almost the same reason. Since then, until he sat down, he has not made another shot. The name of the Ziang Sword Field was therefore renamed Buried Sword Villa. Not long after the flight, Su Changa and the three successfully arrived at the Buried Sword Villa. Looking down from the air, I saw a hundred Zhang Mountain below, and stone. Steps were laid on the mountain, leading to the top of the mountain, winding and winding. Several Taoist temples were built on the top of the mountain, and the Taoist temple was surrounded by a wall, wrapping those temples within the wall. The mountain is not large, Su Changa converted it, it is more than 300 meters. In height, as for the area is even smaller, if the footwork is fast, you can walk around in a blaze of time. He looked to the left side of the mountain, and saw that there was indeed a bridge hole at the foot of the mountain, and there were several locust trees growing at the entrance, and the thick leaves of the locust tree almost blocked the bridge hole. Huh? That is. Suddenly, Su Changa noticed something and frowned. At the foot of the mountain, a disciple wearing a robe made by the buried. Sword Mountain Villa patrolled back and forth around the entire mountain, as if he was guarding it in a strict formation. They would go round and round and soon patrol more than ten laps. Master, Xiao Yu's eyes froze slightly. The bridge hole is inconspicuous, but there are people constantly patrolling. And if you rush in, you will definitely be detected. Su Lianyue's brows were also slightly wrinkled, and she felt slightly troublesome. Su Chunga thought for a moment and said, let's go down first. Soon. The three descended from the clouds and hid in a hidden bush on the ground. Xiao Yu took the Tengu form and reformed into a human form. The reason why she didn't use the Tengu form this time is that she now wants her owner to see more of her graceful figure after growing up. In fact, just now in the cabin, she didn't let Su Changa see it, she just felt very ashamed. Su Lianyue looked up at the entrance of the bridge cave where the patrol team was constantly patrolling, which was very annoying. This buried sword villa is also too vigilant. Xiao Yudai's brows furrowed. Su Changa said in a deep voice, if only there was a technique that could be invisible. I vaguely remember that in those novels I read in my previous life, there was a big villain who could be invisible, and he walked in front of others with his face, and no one else knew about it. If you have this kind of exercise, then when faced with this situation, it will be beautiful. I hope to brush it up in the future. 
At the same time, he also thought of Huang Zhilong, who should have sneaked in. At night while these patrol disciples were lazy and napping. But you can't wait until the evening. Xiao Yu, what can you do? He looked at Xiao Yu. Xiao Yu shook his head and said in a deep voice, or, kill? Wait a minute. Su Xianyue suddenly stopped and said, this kind of little. It's too dirty to kill, I have a way. She took out a bag of spirit stones from her body, waved her wrist, and threw it out. Snap, the white flower spirit stones spilled down, like a rain of spirit stones, throwing beautiful arcs in the air, and finally spilled on the ground in the distance, which was very eye-catching. Fiercely, the disciples of those patrolling buried sword mountain villa lit up. One after another. Groove, spirit stone? Heavenly spirit stone? Good luck is coming, go around, go and pick it up. But that place is some distance away from us, if it is in the past, wouldn't. It. You don't pick it up, I'll go. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. Wait for me. With a few clicks, those disciples walked away. In just three breaths, they returned, holding the glittering spirit stone in their hands, with an ecstatic expression on their faces. But they didn't notice at all that, in just these three breaths, someone had already sneaked into the bridge hole unexpectedly. A thousand lower grade spirit stones, in exchange for a large pool of spiritual milk, capitalists are ashamed of themselves. In the bridge cave, Su Changa said with a smile as he walked. It is true that if you kill those disciples, firstly, it is easy to get your hands dirty, and secondly, it is easy to attract the attention of the buried sword villa, and at that time, if they know that there is originally a spiritual milk here, then the two sides must not fight. Although you are not afraid, you can avoid trouble, and it is better to avoid it. Without him, a waste of time. Master, I smell sweet. Little Cheong moved her nose. She is a dog herself and has a very sensitive sense of smell. Quick. Su Changa led the two women and rushed towards the inside of the bridge cave. In this cave, it is dark and dark, and the air smells of humidity on a rainy day. The further he walked inside, the more Su Changa felt like he was walking downhill, going deep underground. Thinking of what the Dark Soul Emperor said, it was ten thousand meters deep from the ground, and he couldn't help but speed up his pace. Finally, some time later, the three managed to reach the depths of the mountain. The air here is thin, and there is a feeling of lack of oxygen. Su Changa looked at it, and in front of him was an ingenious stalactite cave. Like a blessed land created by heaven and earth, which was breathtaking. Not far away, there was a huge pool, which was really the size of a swimming. Pool as the soul emperor said, and the pool was surrounded by sparkling. Stalactites. As for the inside of the pool, it is filled with pure earth milk, which looks. Like flowing milk to the naked eye flowing milk and honey, and the surface of. The water is steaming with a thick white mist. Wow, it's so fragrant. The little devouring eyes shine. Look, there's a little spoon. Su Lianyue was more careful, and her eyes observed a small wooden spoon by the pool. Next to the wooden spoon, there is also a wooden water cup. Su Chunga glanced at it and said with a smile, it should be that Huang. Jiolong does not dare to absorb too much rashly, for fear of dying from exploding, so he scoops it into the cup with a spoon and drinks it. But I am a clean body, without any impurities, and it is no problem to let go of the guts to absorb. As he spoke, he grabbed the wooden spoon and cup, and burst it with his fingers. Then he walked to the edge of the pool picked up the earth soul milk inside, and took a sip. Lying groove, it's so sweet. 
In the mouth, it is fragrant and sweet, like drinking milk, even sweeter than milk. He simply opened his mouth, dipped his face into the water, and drank it with a grunt. In the end, he simply jumped into the pool and drank to his heart's content. Even if your clothes are wet, you can't care about it. P.S. Thank you for sending out a pop more flowers yesterday, author's daddy. Thank you. Thank you so much. Also, the double ponytail girl hatchery area hashtag hashtag. Goo, one. After another, as if finding the eye of the sea, flowed into Su Changbe's mouth. Then it poured down his throat, and finally traveled down the meridians to the limbs. In an instant, Su Changa felt that the spiritual energy in his body skyrocketed, and his whole spirit was uplifted, his face was full of red light, and he couldn't say it was cool. At this moment, he only felt that the earth's soul was milked into his body and instantly turned into pure aura, spreading and circulating in his body, washing away all the meridians and filling the meridians with incomparable solidity. And those meridians also began to grow larger and thicker, the internal spiritual energy was abundant, and the body became very powerful in just a few moments. The breath swells. The meridians thicken. The bones also thickened. Zhao, Zha, Zha. Suddenly, there were one after another sounds in the body. A majestic breath then pervaded. Boom. Breakthrough. Heavenly gate realm is a heavy heaven. Heavenly gate realm triple heaven. Heavenly gate realm five heavens. Heavenly gate realm seven heavens. Heavenly gate realm nine heavens. When the sound of the breakthrough stopped, Su Changa found that his cultivation had skyrocketed to a large realm in just a few breaths. The six realms of Tong Tian, Tianqi, Tianqian, Tianmen, Tianka, Tianyuan, Tiangang. Cool. He looked at this pool full of soul milk, and his heart was really refreshed. To the point of numbness. I have to say that killing people and setting fire to the gold belt, robbing people of opportunities will make you rich, and the Dark Soul Emperor is really his own treasure-hunting rat. Immediately, he simply plunged into the water and absorbed it to his heart's content with absorption. Boom. Breakthrough. Breakthrough again. Crazy breakthrough. Tianka realm is a heavy heaven. Heavenly science realm, triple heaven. Tianka realm, five heavens. Heavenly science realm, seven heavens. Heavenly science realm, nine heavens. With the breakthrough. Su Chongga also felt that the strength in his body was skyrocketing, and the huge force of 500 million gene was rolling with Xiu Wei at this moment. 550 million. 5,190 million. 600 million. 650 million. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. Meanwhile, the vast Tianka realm breath swept across and rolled, and the air was like boiled seawater, rumbling and shaking. For a time, with the buried sword villa as the center, within a radius of thousands of miles, all shook. Above the sky, the clouds tremble and the waves are raging. The white clouds stirred by this breath seemed to cause a tsunami, rolling violently, and the waves rushed into the sky. Above the buried sword villa, the clouds boiled, layer after layer exploded, soaring into the sky, like a heavenly sword, about to pierce the sky. And in that air, there was a crackling explosion, Zhao, 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 the sound continued, like a strong man breaking his own limits at this moment. Entering the hall, and undergoing a huge transformation. Buzz. At this moment, bury the sword villa. Tens of thousands of long swords buzzed in unison, as if they had encountered 
the sword monarch, trembling violently. In front of him. When a famous sword cultivator saw this scene, he was completely dumbfounded. And immediately turned his head and looked at the sky with a shocked. Expression. Someone enlightened? This. Triggering the celestial phenomena, ten thousand swords and cicadas. Chirping, this. Which senior brother is it? Such a strong breath, I wonder which senior brother broke that shackle and triggered such a vision? I just swept away my divine sense, and my cultivation actually showed signs of loosening, and I greatly benefited. At this moment, the generation of palm sect of the buried sword villa walked out of the hall with a pale face, looking at the sky, and endless shock flashed in his heart. This this is the breath of the Tanka realm, and someone has broken through. The Tanka realm. The buried sword villa is only an ordinary weak force in the host domain, and no one in the gate has ever stepped into the Tanka realm, not even the sect. Leader in the Middle Ages. But now, there are disciples who have stepped into the Tanka realm. The master said he was panicked. After all, this aura erupted from inside the buried sword villa, triggering the celestial phenomena, and ten thousand swords trembled. That must be his own disciple. Excited. This master immediately went to wake up the ancestor. Not long after, in a hall with carved beams and paintings inside the self. Buried sword villa, an old man with a crutch and a face full of decayed and Dead people walked out quickly. Great luck. What a blessing. This. Old ancestor looked up at the sky and cheered excitedly. Buried sword villa has produced such a tanjiao, it cannot be described as. Unhappy, it cannot be described as unlucky. Just. The next moment, they sensed something was wrong. The breath of this tanka realm is very strange. Neither of them knew each other. As the master sect and the ancestor, they were very familiar with the breath of every disciple in the gate, but although this breath erupted from within the mountain villa, it was a very strange breath. What's going on? Hey, why is the mountain shaking gently? The palm sect suddenly noticed something, and his brows furrowed sharply. The old ancestor of the buried sword villa also tightened his heartstrings. When he boarded. Then I noticed that the ground under my feet was shaking slightly. And the Taoist temple of the entire mountain villa was shaking slightly. It was as if someone inside the mountain had erupted with great divine power. And the entire mountain was shaking. This. There are people inside the mountain. The ancestor of the buried sword villa quickly discovered the situation. Quick. Go over and take a look. In the stalactite cave. A pool full of soul milk, madly pushing Suchanga's cultivation, making his cultivation skyrocket, and he couldn't stop at all. Boom. Breakthrough. Breakthrough again. Tianyuan realm is a heavy heaven. Tianyuan Realm, Triple Heaven. Tianyuan Realm, Five Heavens. Tianyuan Realm, Seventh Heaven. Tianyuan Realm, Nine Heavens. Repair to rub up, like riding a rocket to upgrade. Outside. The ancestor of the buried sword villa and the palm sect searched for a long time and they didn't find how to find that breath. It is clear that it erupted from the inside of the mountain, but I searched for it, but I couldn't find where the entrance was. How to get into the mountain? This question baffles them. Confused. Time has come to dusk imperceptibly. Sunset West Mountain, Sunset West Slope. In the stalactite cave, Suchanga cultivated for this day, and soon crossed. The entire Tong Tian realm, breaking through the heavenly gang in one fell. Swoop and entering the forgiveness realm. Forgive the six realms, Fong Ling, Fong Marquis, Fong King, Fong Jiang, Fong. Official, Fong Zen. After arriving at the Amnesty Realm, 
Xiu Wei continued to rise and soon arrived at the Feng King. When he arrived here, most of the pool of earth's soul milk remained, and Su. Changa stopped absorbing it. Enough has been absorbed, and the rest, give mercy, and little eater. Eat meat yourself, but you can't let your subordinates have no meat to eat. He didn't want to learn from the one in his previous life, follow his eldest brother, and go hungry for three days. In all fairness, he couldn't do it. And now it's almost dark, in case Huang Jiolong comes, it's not good. Instead of cheap Huang Jiolong, it is really better that fertile water does not flow into the fields of outsiders. I didn't have time to absorb it anyway, hurry. Mercy, Xiao Yu, don't talk nonsense, come in and absorb. Su Changa waved his hand and greeted them. Su Lianyue burst into tears all of a sudden. Gongzi, if you absorb it to your heart's content, you are likely to step into the next realm star soul realm, why give it to me? There are so many whys, if you want to come in, you will come in quickly. Su. Changa was extremely domineering, and also turned his head to look at Xiao. Yu, whose lips were squirming and almost shed tears, and said, don't cry, if I have a bite to eat, there will definitely be yours, come in. Well, Master Xia. Xiao Yu nodded with tears, she knew that the master was very good to herself, just like the terrifying number of spirit stones last time, didn't she also absorb all of them? Immediately, enter the pool. Su Lianyue also entered the pool. After entering the pool, the two of them quickly soaked their clothes a little, but Su Lianyue didn't care about so much, and moved closer to Su. Changa's side. Only when she is close to Gongzi's side can she feel safe. Xiaoyu also swam to Su Changa's side and leaned against his shoulder. What? Boom. Rumble. Almost. At the moment of absorption, their cultivation soared rapidly at an incredible speed. Breakthrough. Crazy breakthrough. Heaven and man realm one heavy heaven. Heaven and human realm nine heavens. A heavy heaven in the will see realm. Nine heavens of the will see realm. Yuanfu realm is a heavy heaven. Yuanfu realm nine heavens. Dogu. Su Lianyue's cultivation skyrocketed, and soon arrived at Tianren from the transformation dragon, and then quickly skyrocketed to the Dao Palace, which was able to stop. Before the Void God Realm, acquired days, Chi Si, Metamorphosis, Golden Body, Dharma Phase, Moving Blood, Divine Palace, Nirvana, Dong Tian, Hualong Dragon, Tianren, Luanhai, Yuanfu, Dao Palace, Cave Void. Then, she began to look at her own changes. Breaking through to the Dao Palace Realm, the changes brought to her body are not a star and a half, she can clearly feel that a deep force circulates in her body, meeting mountains and mountains, meeting altitude and sea, like a violent wind sweeping through heaven and earth, flowing in every corner of her body. And over there, Xiao Yue has also received a huge sublimation, rubbing and soaring. Nirvana Realm is a heavy heaven. Nirvana Realm Duo Heaven. Nirvana Realm Four Heavens. Nirvana Realm Eight Heavens. Nirvana Realm Nine Heavens. Cave Heaven. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. Almost at the same time, Xiaoyu Xiao broke through Nirvana and stepped into the cave sky. This cultivation needs to open up a hole in the body. Otherwise, it will not be able to continue to rise. Xiao Yu, now you understand why I let you in and absorb it. Su Changa threw a smile at her. Xiao Yu instantly realized. It turned out that the master was planning to let himself use this earth's soul. Milk to open up the cave sky. So much soul milk, it must be enough to open up the sky. 
It turns out that the owner has long thought of it for himself. For a time, she was moved in her heart, tears flowed uncontrollably, and her red lips squirmed, Master, I. Su Chonga noticed that the sky was getting darker and darker outside, and he decisively couldn't waste any more time. Yes, Master. Xiao Yu wiped away the tears that were touched and immediately began to absorb them. Boom. Soon, the first cave sky opened. Follow along. The second cave. The third cave. The fourth cave sky. The fifth cave sky. The sixth cave. The seventh cave. The eighth cave. The ninth cave sky. Fu Xiaoyu took a long deep breath. Then immediately began the next wave of opening up, without stopping. Boom. A deafening explosion resounded in all directions. Dong Tian continues to open. The eleventh cave heaven. The twelfth cave. The fourteenth cave. The seventeenth cave. The nineteenth cave. The twenty-first cave heaven. The twenty-second cave heaven. I have to say that the bloodline of the flood desolate ferocious beast is extremely strong, with the blessing of the power of the bloodline, coupled with the nourishment of the earth's soul milk, Xiaoyu has successfully opened up twenty-two cave heavens. In an instant, the magnificent legendary cave weather swept out, like a dragon. Cloud spitting mist, and the heavenly goddess scattered flowers, sweeping in all directions. And with the opening of the cave sky, Xiaowei immediately began to roll, and the boom skyrocketed. Cave Heaven Realm Nine Heavens Nine Heavens of the Dragon Realm Heaven and Human Realm Nine Heavens Nine Heavens of the Will Sea Realm Yuanfu Realm Nine Heavens Boom! The breath of the Yuan Mansion was surging, and the entire stalactite cave was buzzing violently and shaking. Shall you step into the Yuanfu realm? And at the moment, the pool full of earth's soul milk is absorbed. As far as the eye can see, the pool is dozens of feet deep, the bottom is all white sand, and there is not a drop of spirit milk. Ha ha ha, eat dry wipe, happy. Su Changa laughed loudly. Originally, he was still worried where to find something to open up the sky. For Xiao Yu. But just now on the way to absorb, I thought about it and was overjoyed. This doesn't have time to absorb the thorough earth soul milk, can't it be? Used to open up the cave heaven? Opening up the cave heaven requires extremely precious heavenly materials and earth treasures, and the consumption speed is extremely fast. Therefore, it is just enough to eat and wipe these earth soul milk dry in a short time. Suddenly, the two difficult problems in front of you were solved. Xiao Yu and Su Xianyue were about to steam their clothes with coercion, but at this moment, they suddenly heard a sound of footsteps. Lao Zhu found it. It turns out to be here. Ha ha ha, I've been looking for a day, and finally found it, but I didn't. Expect that the ruined bridge hole was connected to such a secret passage, not bad. Xiao Yu's face changed and said, It's a man's voice. Su. Lian Yu's eyes were also cold. Gongzi, don't you have a tower? Let's get inside. Su Xianyue shouted, The two of us are soaked now, we can't let other men see it. Su. Chang'e decisively took out the Heaven and Earth Shanhuang Pagoda, and as soon as his mind moved, the pagoda portal opened, and Xiao Yu and Lier instantly became the size of fingers and entered the tower. Subsequently, the green dragon moon knife appeared in Su Chang Singer, his eyes staring out of the stalactite cave, ready to burst out at any time to burst into the eight wilderness. Boom! Step. Footsteps came from far and near, very fast. It didn't take long. An old man and a middle-aged man appeared outside the stalactite cave. 
These two are not others, they are the ancestors of the buried sword villa, and this generation of masters. My God, the powerhouse of the Fengwang realm. Just now it was only the Tianke realm, and now it is already the King realm. Is it so terrifying? Oh Master! Unexpectedly, in our buried sword villa, there was a high-ranking person living in seclusion, he should be accumulated now. We got lucky. If you can form a good relationship with this master, in the future. Good, just do as you say. The sound is not loud, but with Su Chang's perception, it is clear to listen. It turns out that these two people regard me as a superior person who lives in seclusion here. Speaking of which, the bridge and cave are inconspicuous, and now there is movement, they must subconsciously think that there are masters who are repairing here. He slowly put away the green dragon moon knife. Knock knock. There was a sound of banging on the stone wall outside, which seemed to be used as a knock on the door. Then, an old and respectful voice sounded, Senior, disturb you, just your breakthrough aura alarmed us, now. Do you see how convenient it is for us to enter? The palm sect immediately said, if it is inconvenient for the senior, we will immediately retreat. Suchanga rolled his eyes and said, come in. Senior Xia, the ancestor of the buried sword villa, walked in with the palm sect. When they saw that Su Changa was extremely young and vigorous, they were stunned. It immediately became clear. The true body of this senior must be an old monster who has not been born for a long time. In this world, there are many powerful people with gray beards, but they all like to turn themselves into a young man. Senior, if you live in seclusion with us, don't say a word, if you had known. We would definitely bring you good wine and wine every day. The palm sect of the buried sword villa, clasped his fists, and bent down to salute. The ancestor of the buried sword villa, on the side, also hurriedly handed over. His hand, senior, I don't know if you are lonely here in seclusion. Do you need us to bring us some gourmet jelly? As they spoke, the two of them were also looking at this stalactite cave, as well as the dried up and depleted earth milk pool that had long been absorbed. Immediately, he sighed in his heart, the senior actually opened up the inside of the bridge and cave so comfortably, as if it was a ghostly work, it was really powerful. Especially that pool, it is even more ingenious, it seems that the seniors should usually sit in it and cultivate alone, this is the real worldly. Master. What is a high man? Quietly secluded, the divine dragon sees the head and does not see the end. The place where you live is naturally like a heaven and earth, which is breathtaking. Now, I finally saw the legendary master with my own eyes. The two thought that this stalactite cave was the cave opened by Suchanga. And their hearts suddenly felt like they had discovered a treasure, and they were ecstatic. No need. Suchanga smiled lightly and waved his hand, this seat has been in retreat. Here for three hundred years, and has long lost interest in gourmet jelly, and today it is time to leave. Since the other party thinks that he is a master who lives in seclusion here, why not push the boat smoothly? Then, take the opportunity to get out of here with a big swagger. Senior is leaving? As soon as he heard that Su Changa was leaving, the ancestor of the buried sword villa and the palm sect suddenly felt a pang in their hearts, and a feeling like a weightless treasure surged in their hearts, and the old ancestor hurriedly retained, Senior, can't ah, did we disturb you? Let's go. Let's go. No, no, Su Changa shook his head and smiled, you can also see that I have. Achieved great achievements, and I have broken through from the Tianka realm. To the King Sealing realm, and it is time to be born. Finish speaking. 
He added, this seat has already decided, so there is no need to say more. This, the old ancestor of the buried sword villa, and the palm sect felt as uncomfortable as if they had lost a treasure, lost their souls, sad, and their hearts were about to break. It was hard to see a high-ranking man, and he was still living in seclusion in his own territory, but he didn't expect him to leave. This is like the grand prize is around you, but you never know it, and when you know, you will lose it. For a time, the two were extremely lost in their hearts and hung their heads. But he didn't dare to slacken, and the old ancestor of the buried sword villa respectfully said, you have been in retreat here for so long, but the junior knows nothing, this is too impolite, he took out a gilded sword and handed it over, this is the most precious treasure of the junior mountain villa, called the flying rainbow sword, its preciousness is not in sharpness, but in speed. Fly with this sword, you can travel thousands of miles every day, fast. As lightning. The juniors took this object as an apology gift to the seniors. And hoped that the seniors would not shirk. The palm sect secretly extended his thumb to his ancestor. Apologies are fake, making friends is true, and the ancestor did a beautiful job. As long as you can make friends with this high-ranking person, he is not here. So what's the harm? Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. I'm afraid that I won't be able to make friends with him, not that he's not. Here. Suchanga was never pretentious, and took the flying rainbow sword with a wave of his big hand and then smiled quietly, you're welcome. You're welcome, you're welcome, senior, you're really polite. Seeing the master accept his gift, the old ancestor of the buried sword villa suddenly felt numb with joy, and the old face was flushed. Okay, you guys go outside and wait first, this seat has other things to do. Su Changa said with a smile. The sparkling stalactites by the pool are not ordinary stones, and if you take them out, you will definitely be able to sell them for a lot of money. Moreover, this stalactite cave is full of rare ores, how can it be done? Without emptying? Also, that pool is the condensation of the earth's spiritual chi, then there must be a source, and it is worthy of yourself if you don't take it away? Follow the wishes of your predecessors. The ancestor of the buried sword. Dilla and the palm sect respectfully retreated. Making sure they were far away, Su Chunga's heart moved, and he opened the portal of the Shanhuang Pagoda of Heaven and Earth. Lear and Xiaoyu had already steamed their clothes at this time, and there. Figures walked out of the tower in a float. Subsequently, Su Chunga informed what happened just now those two people. Just now, Su. Samue and Xiaoyu understood what happened, and they were immediately happy, and said, what a. Immediately. The three began to loot. First, cut out all the stalactites on the edge of the pool and walk away, and then start lifting the bricks. Even to the end. Dig the ground three feet into the ground and get everything that looks valuable. Before long, the entire stalactite cave became walled and dilapidated, like a slum in disrepair. In addition to stalactites, there are various rare ores, shortage stones, high-grade stalactites, and valuable stone hoops. These are all things that are difficult to find in the outside world. After making sure that the stalactite cave was completely empty, Suchanga jumped in and re-entered the pool. He searched for a long time at the bottom of the pool, but he did not find where the source of the center of the earth was. Divine consciousness swept away, empty. Eventually, he came to a conclusion. It has been sucked dry, there is nothing left. I can only say that I can really fucking eat and wipe clean. But since you have already gone to the bottom of the pool, if you don't go, Along with something, then how can you do it? 
adhering to the principle that thieves do not fall short, even if you dig some. Sand and walk. Well. Play the ground to the end. Thinking like this, he dug up some white sand and installed it in the Shanhuang Pagoda of Heaven and Earth. Immediately, he walked out with Lianer and Xiaoyu. Along the path they walked, the three managed to reach the outside world after some time. The ancestor of the buried sword villa and the palm sect had been waiting at the entrance of the bridge for a long time, and when they saw that the master came out, they hurriedly stepped forward to salute. As for the two women who suddenly appeared, they shouted in their hearts, it turned out that the seniors were not idle in seclusion, should play, ah, should soak women or bubbles, wonderful, worthy of being a superior person. The ancestor of the buried sword villa was impressed in his heart. The palm teacher also said in his heart, I am a model for generations. Su Changa glanced at them and instructed, after the main seat leaves, this place must be closed, and no one is allowed to enter, not even the two of you. Do you understand? Nonsense, what kind of waste has been made inside, if these two go in and take a look, then they can't detect anything on the spot? Yes. Predecessor. The ancestor of the buried sword villa and the palm sect immediately sent people to seal this formation layer by layer, blocking a total of 1,299 stone gates inside. Immediately, Su Changa harnessed the flying rainbow sword, carried the two women, and left dashingly. The flying rainbow sword was as fast as lightning, and the three disappeared without a trace in an instant. How fast and how fast to slip. The ancestor of the buried sword villa looked at the disappearing afterimage. In the sky from afar, his face full of red light, and he was overjoyed. The palm sect beside him suddenly remembered something, and said suspiciously. Old ancestor, that sword is a sharp weapon for rushing, you usually use it too. Hurry how cool, but why don't you give other things, it's just. Xiao Chen, you are still too young, without waiting for the palm sect, to finish speaking, the ancestor of the buried sword villa interrupted him. Holding his beard and smiling triumphantly, I gave a flying sword to my senior, every time he rushed, he would definitely think of us, for a long time. This relationship is stable, ha ha ha. When the palm teacher heard this, he was immediately overjoyed and said with a smile, Old Ancestor Ing Ming. Learn a little. Whoosh. P.S. Thanks, Evil March. A gift from a tip. There is also, Long Jia of Dragon King Mansion, user 11122150, Fried Sky. Gang. Xiao Koriko. User 10982911, 7, Idol Immortal, Sanike Seedlings of Aoyama. I wish you good luck, success in your wishes, and a bright future. Not long after Su Changa left, a bright moon gradually rises high in the sky, hanging high on the branches. And time enters the night. Phew. A figure came from the direction of the Taishian Daozong, sneakily arrived at. The buried sword villa, black pupils sneaking around, tiptoeing forward in the dark, groping towards the bridge hole. This person is not someone else, it is Huang Zhoulong. He he he, as long as I can absorb all the soul milk in this place, then my strength will definitely skyrocket before the tournament, and when the time comes, it will be born and overwhelm the crowd. He covered his mouth and snickered while groping. Soon, Huang Zhoulong groped to the entrance of the bridge cave. However, looking around, something that surprised him appeared. I saw that the entrance of the bridge cave, the torches were clear, the guards were strict, and the figures holding swords stood there like beams, guarding the entrance layer by layer, their eyes vigilantly scanning the surroundings. Not letting go of any wind and grass. I grass. Huang Jiolong chuckled in his heart, 
and his face changed greatly on the spot. What's going on? What's going on? Did they discover the secret inside the bridge? In an instant, his heart went up and down, his eyes turned red violently, and he roared in his heart, it's impossible, it's mine, no one wants to take it. Away. If that's the case, then what can he do? He took immediate action. Whoosh. In the dark night, there was a sharp sound of air tearing. Immediately after, the sword light and shadow burst out. Enemy attack. Enemy attack. The disciples of the buried sword villa suddenly screamed, and they all danced. Their swords and killed them. But they were no match for Huang Jiolong at all. Although Huang Jiolong's cultivation is not too high, his cultivation is all. The martial arts of the Tai Xian Dao sect, and those exercises are extremely strong, as long as he does not encounter the buried sword mountain villa sect. Or the ancestor level, he can kill them. Poof. Poof. Soon, the disciples of the buried sword villa fell one by one. This speed proceeded very quickly, and in the blink of an eye, the entrance to the bridge cave was full of corpses. Humph. Huang Jiolong snorted coldly and entered the bridge cave. However, as soon as he entered the bridge cave, he was immediately stunned. Looking at it, there is a stone door in front of you, like a wall, extremely thick and strong. Um grass, is this, really? Huang Jiolong was impatient in his heart, and slammed open the stone door with a punch. However, after popping open, there was still a stone gate behind. Huang Jiolong was anxious and angry, running his fist technique, and a strong light appeared on his fist, like an iron fist, and he slammed into the stone. Gate one punch after another. After a long time, he finally smashed the 1,299 stone gates, his tired legs were limp, and he gasped heavily. Fuck, I'm exhausted. But it's finally here. Huang Jiolong laughed and entered the stalactite cave. But as soon as he stepped in, the smile on his face froze on the spot. At a glance, what did it look like half a minute ago? The earth's spiritual milk dried up and dried up, and all the stalactites were emptied. All the treasures are also packed. Even the ground was dug three feet into the ground, and you can clearly see the ruthlessness of the loot from the excavation marks. Here, only the empty stalactite cave remains. No, this empty and tattered appearance can no longer be called a stalactite cave, it can almost be described as a ruin. Groove. Huang Jiolong's whole person froze in place, and his heart was dripping blood. Did this horse encounter a devil? There is not one left, the ground is full of holes, and even the pebbles have been cut away by Lao Tzu. How can there be such a dry and clean person under the sky? He screamed again and again, in disbelief, and was disappointed. One did not stand firmly, and sat on the ground with one butt. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. That's a pool full of soul milk. Originally, in his calculations, he had the spirit milk, which was enough to pile up cultivation to an outrageous point before the tournament. But now, it's all gone. Before he could be sad for a second, a loud drink suddenly sounded outside the stalactite cave. Quick. Someone broke in, quick. Damn, block the outside layer by layer, don't let this person escape. Whoosh. Step. 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 The sound of thick footsteps approached inches. Huang Jiolong's heart was shocked. He had already sensed that it was the palm. Sect of the buried sword villa and the ancestor and many disciples, his face turned white and he hurriedly took out a temporary outbreak of pills and swallowed it and then a treasure knife appeared in his hand, roared, and 
desperately killed outward. Five hours later, Huang Jiolong finally killed it, but he was also seriously injured, and there were wounds all over his body, and he could see by Sun Sun's bones inside. Through the wound, and the blood was dripping. It's not suitable to fight, it's the best strategy. He panicked, and instantly sacrificed a flying sword and fled without a trace. Hateful, this person actually emptied all the stalactite holes, it's really hateful. After Huang Jiolong left, the sect leader and old ancestor of the buried sword villa were furious, but the other party seemed to have a lot of whole cards on them, and they were desperate. It's hard for them to stay. Huang Jiolong was far away, and he also heard a roar from behind. Suddenly, he was so angry that he didn't hold back, and spewed out a mouthful of blood. It is clear that someone else hollowed out the stalactite hole, what do you do? But he naturally wouldn't be stupid enough to go back and explain, and he escaped without a trace. Somewhere, a green-robed youth and an old gray-clothed servant collapsed on the ground, blood dripping from the corners of their mouths. Not far away, a huge saber-toothed tiger opened its blood basin and rolled with thick oppression on its body, approaching them step by step. Young master, you run, I'll break the back. The old servant roared, drew his sword, and slammed into the saber-toothed. Tiger. The two of them entered this mountain range today, to look for medicinal herbs. But unexpectedly ran into this fierce saber-toothed tiger, they were no match. At all, and they were hit hard before they could even survive a move in the hands of the saber-toothed tiger. If nothing else, today will become the mouth of this demon beast. At this time, the green-robed young man's whole person was completely frozen. On the ground, under the powerful oppression of the fierce beast, his teeth trembled violently, his body trembled, and he was creepy. Don't talk about running, you don't even have the strength to stand up. Young master, run quickly, or it'll be too late. The old servant burned his eyebrows and drank anxiously. The next moment, the saber-toothed tiger slapped his palm and instantly slapped him out, and there was a shockwave-like shock in the air, and the old servant was slapped and flew to the distant branches. He kicked his legs and rushed out with this force, laughing while fleeing. Young master, you can't support the wall with mud on your horse if you don't. Escape, I will escape. In the blink of an eye, he fled. The saber-toothed tiger glanced at him, did not chase, and pressed towards the green-robed youth step by step. My life is resting, the green-robed young man closed his eyes in despair. This saber-toothed tiger is a demon beast of the void realm, not to mention. One him, it is ten him, and he will die here today. Benefactor, take care of my sister, when. He was about to die, he returned to the light, remembering the benefactor who saved him last time in Panlong Mountain. In his mind, a figure dressed in white gradually emerged. Just when he was desperate, the abnormality suddenly happened. Ugh. Three figures rained down from the sky. The one in the front, white-clothed Xingxue, black hair like ink, like a sun. Of Xuexiu turned his back to him like that, and said lightly, Am I late? It's not late. The green-robed young man was stunned, and he was overjoyed. In an instant. That's good. The white-cloaked figure waved his palm, and the powerful king sealing realm. Coercion burst out instantly. Looking at the saber-toothed tiger, the power in his body tumbled, and he punched out. Boom. A terrifying punch erupted, like thunder and lightning in the night. The concussive air exploded, the sonic boom boiled, and slammed towards the saber-toothed tiger. Boom. The powerful force hit the skull of the saber-toothed tiger in an instant, like a meteorite smashing eggs, the saber-toothed tiger could not 
Dodge, the head exploded on the spot, and blood mixed with broken bones. Splashed everywhere. And this punch is still full of power, and it continues to blast deep into its body. Boom. Bang bang bang. A series of crackling bone explosions suddenly sounded in the saber-toothed tiger's body, and the entire body was shattered by the bones bombarded by this. Punch in an instant, plopping down on the ground, and a whimper. This. Strong. It's too strong. The green-robed young man looked at the saber-toothed tiger that exploded into. A blood mist, his mouth was trembling, and when he came back to his senses, he. Was immediately very happy. Fortunately, at the critical moment, this benefactor came again and saved his. Life, which is really. The sky has eyes. And here, Su Changa turned his head to look at him and said lightly, I. Didn't expect to meet you again. He. Was flying with the imperial sword just now, and suddenly heard the sound of. Fighting below, looked down, and immediately recognized this green-robed. Youth. The green-robed young man is not a bystander, it is Ji Shenyu's brother. What a good man. Benefactor, you are such a good man. Meeting you in my life. Is really a blessing from my previous life. The. Green-robed young man was extremely happy, his excited teeth trembled, and his. Whole body was trembling. It really scared him just now. Now that he has escaped from death, he only feels a chill in his spine and a. Cold sweat. Su Changa smiled and said, it's good if you're happy. He is not a good person, he just wants to collect this crystal nucleus from. The saber-toothed tiger. And that punch, he also mastered the strength, otherwise the saber-toothed. Tiger would have exploded into a blood mist long ago. Benefactor, how happened during this time after my sister left with you? The green-robed youth asked again at this time. Su Changa smiled and said, Your sister is very good. The green-robed young man still wanted to say something more, Su Changa hurriedly said, You go quickly, this mountain range is very dangerous, in case a stronger demon beast comes, I can't deal with it, it will be miserable. The green-robed young man hurriedly surrendered his hand and thanked him, Thank you very much, then I will leave. He stood up on the ground and left quickly. When the green-robed youth walked away, Su Changa flashed to the corpse of the saber-toothed tiger, pulled out his wrist, and took out a sparkling crystal nucleus from it. Then he got up and took the two women away. Just after walking two steps, he suddenly had an epiphany, and said to himself, Hey, why don't I see if I can remove impurities from the beast? Core. Just do what you say, and immediately run the quenching spirit secret. Technique. With a glance, he immediately saw through the more than six thousand kinds of impurities in this crystal nucleus. Even the purest part of the demon beast's body has impurities. Su Changa did not waste time and pointed at the crystal nucleus. Zhao, a familiar voice sounded. The impurities in the crystal nucleus were removed one after another, and only the true essence remained. Hey, this is, after. Removing the impurities, the demon beast crystal nucleus emitted a strange light, becoming like a fireball, which made Su Changa's eyes can't help but condense. He didn't see what it was. Never seen it. The beautiful master did not say anything about the beast core. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. Su Xianyue was suddenly overjoyed at this time, Gongzi, congratulations. This is the ultimate flame attribute beast core. Ultimate flame attribute beast core? Su Changa was overjoyed in his heart and said, in other words, this demon beast is a fire attribute demon beast? That's right. 
Su Lianyue's smile was like a flower, this saber-toothed. Tiger has grown to a certain realm, the beast core is very extraordinary, and the beast core of this attribute is only one of the many beast cores in the world, in addition to the flame attribute beast core, there are also Inmu. Attribute beast core, red metal beast core, cold ice attribute. Buried. Buried. The corners of Su Chunga's mouth raised and said, I really didn't expect that there would be such an unexpected gain. Fortunately, I had a whim to remove impurities from the beast core. If this is given to a beautiful master, I don't know what kind of rare things will be brushed out. Immediately, he sacrificed the flying rainbow sword and beckoned, okay. Mercy, shall you, go. Hmm. Xiao Yu and Su Lianyue stepped on the flying sword, and the three of them soared into the air. Along the way, Su Changa stood on the tip of the sword, and the two of them were behind him. Along the way, the breeze is sultry and dashing. During the flight, Su Changa was also calculating how many pounds of strength he had gained when he broke through cultivation just now. A figure was quickly obtained. 1.5 billion caddies. This is a terrifying number, if it breaks out, Yugong will not have to work. So hard back then. Not enough. Although it was strong enough, Su Changda still let out a dissatisfaction. Not satisfied. His thirst for strength made him unsatisfied. He shouted in his heart, I have to quickly raise it to 20 billion gene and be able to hold the god king Dao. At this time, Xiaoyu looked at the scene of rapid regression on both sides and suddenly said, Master, no, this doesn't seem to be the direction of returning to the sect? Su Changa said with a smile, of course not, first find a place to sell those rare stones looted from the stalactite cave for money. Sell things for money? Xiaoyudai's eyebrows frowned slightly and then he laughed and said, did I absorb so many spirit stones and run out of money? She had absorbed Su Changa's 4,850 trillion spirit stones at one time before. Su Changa patted her graceful willow waist and said with a smile, that's not it, but who would be afraid of too much money? That's why you want to make money. Who would have too much money under the sun? Isn't it perfect to sell these things, go back and directly find the beautiful master to brush subsidies and get more money? Su Lianyue opened her mouth and asked, Gongzi, where are we going? You'll know when you get to the place, keep it secret for now. Su Changa smiled. These words aroused Su Xianyue's curiosity, she pouted, and said, Oh, Gongzi. When did you become so bad, hooking the heart of Lianer, Su? Changa took her into his arms, touched her graceful waist, and said with a smile, Haven't I always been so bad? Su Xianyue's cheeks were red, and she let out a gentle hmm and lowered her head. Su Changa didn't waste too much time, and as soon as his mind moved, the flying rainbow sword cut through the sky and flew rapidly in one direction. But soon, he realized something was wrong. It was clear that it had been a moment of incense, why did the mountain range that had just killed the saber-toothed tiger appear in front of it? Xiaoyu also sensed something at this time, and said in a deep voice, Master, why are you flying around and always spinning in place? Su Lianyue's eyes flashed and said, We have won the illusion. As soon as the words fell, an evil voice suddenly came. Oh, that's smart, but so what? You can't do without this today. This voice sounded ethereal and illusory, like the person who spoke in the distance, but like the person who spoke in his ear, very strange. Su Chunga smiled coldly and shouted, Who is farting? Get out! Oh, look at you in a hurry, I can't hold my breath on this matter, I really... Don't know how you captured the hearts of these two beautiful women. The space fluctuated, and a black-robed figure walked out of it. 
His figure was like a gust of wind, ethereal, a phantom. Su Chonga looked up, and saw that he was full of anger, with an eagle hook. Nose, full of demonic energy, and it was clearly a demon road. He stared at Su Chonga, and said coldly, Why do you have two such beautiful women following you, but I don't have any, what is this heavenly reason? Su Chonga couldn't help but be happy, and said with a smile, Nonsense, I'm so handsome, isn't it very conforming to heaven that peach blossom luck is? Very prosperous? The black-robed figure patted his forehead and said grimly, I can't get used to people like you, go and die. He raised his hand and pointed out, lightning and thunder in the air, thunder. In an instant, a meteorite crushed the void, as if smashed down from the Atmosphere, the visual senses were extremely terrifying, terrifying. Gongzi, this is not a real meteorite, it's an illusion. Xiaoyu said in a deep voice. Su Chang'e naturally knew this. In the fantasy realm, all attacks are illusory. If this person can really summon a meteorite with one finger, what level of cultivation does it have to be? Gongzi, break his illusion. Su Xianyue let out a rare sneer. Gongzi sword technique, specializing in illusion magic, this person is really close to the face to death. As soon as her words came out, the black-robed figure glanced at Su Chang'e contemptuously, and sneered, break my illusion? Does he have that ability? Speaking of this, he let out a longing laugh, when I kill him, you too. Hey! That's what he's here for today. Su Chongda is too lazy to talk nonsense with this figure, this is just a phantom, the real body is not here, if you want to kill him, you need to break. The illusion first, the mouth cannon is useless. As soon as his mind moved, the green dragon moon knife appeared in his hand. And the rolling mysteries, contained in mad knife silent annihilation, and Eight wilderness ran in his body, and he slashed out. Sting. A beam of sword light, mighty, gushing out, like a dazzling thunderbolt. Instantly set off a terrifying sound explosion, slashing fiercely on the meteorite. With a loud bang, the meteorite exploded, and endless rubble splashed in all directions. Then, the scene in front of me changed drastically, and the mountains below disappeared, replaced by a large river, with waves and rumbling sounds. That figure was also broken with the illusion and dissipated inch by inch. Su Chang'e looked around and found that not far away a middle-aged man in a black robe had a stiff expression, spitting out three mouthfuls of blood, and trembled, you. You can break my illusion. The illusion was broken, he was eaten back, the chi and blood in his body turned upside down, and his vitality was greatly injured. Su Chang'e swung the green dragon moon knife and slashed towards him. Wait. The middle-aged man's face changed drastically, and he shouted, Be a person and leave a line, and see each other in the future. Su Chang'e never talked nonsense, holding the green dragon moon knife, his Figure was swift, like a white thunder, flying towards him quickly. Seeing that the other party insisted on killing himself, the middle-aged man was immediately shocked and hurriedly said, and slow, I am willing to give you all the treasures on my body, I only ask you to spare my life. Hearing Read more novels for free on our website tinyurl.com slash 2AA54Z8B. This person say this, Su Chang'e showed a slightly interested smile on his face. His smile was only for a moment, but the middle-aged man had a strong desire to survive, and he immediately caught the smile, and immediately took out a storage bag from his body and offered it over, saying, Senior, there is all. My family wealth here, the middle-aged. Man's face was extremely respectful, but he secretly decided in his heart that 
After this calamity, he must kill this person. Su Chonga came closer, took the storage bag, praised, and said, You are quite aware of current affairs, not bad. The middle-aged man showed a knowing smile and was about to answer, Su Chonga in front of him suddenly burst out, slashing at his head, his body suddenly stiffened in place, his lips suddenly turned blue, and then the whole person fell down and smashed on the ground. After this slash, there was nothing in the middle-aged man's physical body, but the divine soul had been cut off. Suchanga slowly collected the knife, stood with his hands in his hands, and said, I really think I don't know your abacus? Suchanga is young, and in terms of life experience, he is far inferior to this middle-aged man. But as an old bookworm in his previous life, if he thought about it carefully, he immediately understood what kind of calculation this person had. This scene has been written more than once in those novels, before the villain dies, he is willing to give all the treasures on his body to the protagonist. Which seems to be so, but in fact there is a bad intention. When the crisis passes, the villain will lie dormant in secret, until one day he catches the gap and kills the protagonist, by surprise. After killing people, Suchanga opened the storage bag offered by the middle aged man and prepared to check what treasures were inside. But after opening it, his eyes narrowed. At a glance, the storage bag turned out to be empty. What are these treasures? It is clear that they are extremely cunning, and they want to get out if they give an empty bag. Nima, can't you let me meet some brainless villain? Suchanga was speechless. Wearing into this world, if you are a little stupid, then the horse is estimated to have been overcast long ago. Immediately, he lowered his body and fumbled for a while on the middle-aged man's corpse, successfully groping for another storage bag. When I opened it, I immediately shook my head. Inside were some waste pills without aura, as well as more than a dozen. Yellow-level soldiers who did not enter the stream, as well as some green vine. Armor and willow leaf whips, all of which were garbage made of waste, and there was not even half a spirit stone. It's so poor, that you can't even fall off the slag. Master, this person is extremely cunning, and good things should never be put on him. Xiao Yu said in a deep voice. Su Chunga nodded and then prepared to remove the impurities in these things. But when he was about to be eliminated, he suddenly thought of something. Removing impurities from garbage? Then they must not fall apart on the spot. Thinking of this, he was ready to throw it. But suddenly, he had a flash of inspiration and remembered the place where he was going to sell something. His eyes suddenly rolled and he grinned, these garbage are probably far more than the stalactite rocks we sold this time. In that place, the more garbage is sold, the more it is sold, which can be called a huge profit. After all, it was sold that way last time. Xiaoyu and Lear were puzzled and asked, Gongzi, I'm getting more and more curious, where to sell things? Su Changa smiled and said, It's all said, you'll know when you get to the place. P.S. I saw that there was a message in the background asking if it would be upgraded to a higher world, so let's talk about it here. This book is in this world, will not fight monsters all the way to upgrade to a higher world or flood world or something, those routines are too old. Everyone is tired of it, the little author does not want to write, the way to change the map of this book is a lotus-style map change method, you don't feel. To change the map, in fact, the map has been changed many times, this method can always write without upgrading the world, don't worry about collapse, even. If the world has no to write, you can also use the writing method of cross. Overlapping timeline to write, it is equivalent to a variant of the Lotus. Style map changing method, and it can still be written without changing the map. 
Regarding what is the Lotus style image exchange method, it is inconvenient to say more here because of the space, and the big guy who wants to know can leave a message in this paragraph, and the little author will return when he sees it. In addition, to reiterate, this book will not be a eunuch or a bad end or a sudden end, please rest assured to chase after it. After some time, the flying rainbow sword stopped above Mongtong Mountain. Su Changa smiled lightly, this is it. So that's it. Su Lianyue stood high in the sky, looked down, and immediately understood where Gongzi was going to profit. Could it be that Gongzi planned to go to the black market to sell those worthless goods? But it's a little unrealistic, the people who come to the black market are all Extrajudicial maniacs walking on the tip of the knife, one is more refined than a person, how can he be fooled? It's not that she doesn't believe Gongzi, but she's just worried that she won't be able to sell the goods. Xiaoyu was full of confidence in Su Changa. In her mind, the master is omnipotent, and she believes in the master. Su Changa's mind moved, the flying rainbow sword flew downward, and the three fell to the ground. As soon as he stepped into the ground, Su Changa suddenly saw something and said, Hey, why are there so many people this time? At a glance, there are many more stalls in Mangdang Mountain, one after another, it is very lively, there are people selling pills, some selling weapons, some selling spirit fruits, all kinds, and variety. The shouting and haggling were heard from afar. Walk by, don't miss the opportunity, the fresh little Juan Dan, that has just been baked, lose money and sell it, only a thousand spirit stones, what? Too expensive, you say? I go to Nima's, is a thousand spirit stones of this? Level of elixir still expensive? You love to buy or not, get out of the way. Take a walk and take a look, the things here are super cost effective, fried. Spirit fruit is processed at half price, yes, we have developed a new way to eat spirit fruit, that is, put it in a pot and fry it in oil, what do you say? Not delicious? I'll go to your uncle's, if the dog can't spit ivory out of its mouth, you know a ball when you step on a horse, have you tasted it? Just jump to conclusions? The people who came to the black market were all temperamental, and the parcel stall owners, including the parcel stall owners, quarreled without saying a word. Su Chonga muttered, I haven't been here for a while, but I didn't expect it to become so lively here. He didn't care and walked straight inside. While passing by these stalls, suddenly a stall caught his attention. The stall was full of people inside and out and the water was not clear, and the people were hot and enthusiastic. Shall you, mercy, go over and see? Out of curiosity, Su Changa walked over. After finally squeezing into the crowd, he was surprised to find that it turned out to be an antique stall. The stall owner laid a straw mat on the ground, and all kinds of antiques were piled up on the mat like a hill, and these guests were picking and choosing. Among the antiques, as if they were panning for gold. Su Changa was interested and asked, Boss, how are these antiques sold? When a business came to the door, the antique stall owner smiled and said, These are all obtained from ancient tombs, two thousand spirit stones can be picked at will, and you will make a lot of money if you pick up treasures. Su Changa slapped his forehead and understood. No wonder these people are in high spirits, it turns out that they are really panning for gold. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com slash 2AA54Z8B. But who knows which of these antiques is a treasure? The world is treacherous, the human heart is complicated, who knows which of? These antiques is the thing of the old pit? He quietly ran the quenching spirit secret technique, looking at it one by one. Antique Jade Buddha Cone, 4943. 
Impurities, Antique Bronze Table Case, 2323. Impurities, as far as the eye saw, all kinds of antique impurities were. Similar, all thousands of impurities, he looked at it for a long time, did not. See which was a good thing. These things are mixed and difficult to distinguish. On the way, several antiques were picked up. Forget it, gambling dogs, don't end well. Suchanga shook his head and took. Shall Liener to leave. As soon as he turned around, he suddenly remembered something, and his eyes flashed, no, why don't I let the Dark Soul Emperor see, he has lived for endless years, and he must recognize which of these things is a treasure. Thinking of this, he immediately took out half of the spirit stone and awakened the Dark Soul Emperor. Soon, a grain of sand appeared in his hand. Young man, say, who do you want me to see this time? The Dark Soul Emperor was very happy to help Suchanga, that is, to help himself, so he worked very hard. Suchanga transmitted, look at which of these antiques is a real treasure. Haha. <laughs> this is simple. The Dark Soul Emperor swept away with a pair of wise eyes, and it didn't take long to see through all the antiques. When he swept over one of the antiques, his eyes stayed for a moment, and he was pleasantly surprised, young man, this one is full of garbage, only that. One is a real treasure. Suchonga looked at the antiques he said, and saw that it was an old end. Rusty broken sword with many openings, and cracks on it, almost shattering. Isn't this a broken sword? He couldn't help but mutter. The Dark Soul Emperor smiled and said, You know what, it is a treasure from a powerful Daoist system in ancient times, it seems to be broken, but it is actually made of extremely special materials, this material is extremely rare. And rare. If you melt this sword into gold juice, you can get the ancient stone dragon pattern divine gold, and set it on the weapon, which can greatly increase the lethality of the weapon. I just helped you calculate that after this stall owner got this batch of antiques in the ancient tomb, he immediately sold it, and even he didn't know that the broken sword was a treasure, he thought it was just an ordinary sword that was about to shatter. If you buy it and find a place where no one is, I can help you smelt it right away. Before he finished speaking, his figure darkened and fell directly into a deep sleep. Suchonga was not in a hurry to smelt, and it was not too late to wait until he returned to the sect. Immediately, he took out two thousand spirit stones and handed them to the stall owner, and then pretended to pull in the antique pile for a while, and finally got the broken sword, and then left. After he left, many people were still panning for gold here, completely unaware that the real good things had been scooped out from under their noses. Ha ha ha, if you remove the impurities in the dragon pattern divine gold, and then give it to the beautiful master to brush subsidies, the material you will get will definitely be stronger. Then, if it is embedded in the divine king saber, the divine king sword must be even more terrifying. Suchanga walked on the road, looking at the broken sword in his hand. Intently, and his heart was excited. Not to mention the brush subsidy, just two thousand spirit stones in exchange. For an ancient era dragon pattern cloud gold, this is enough to earn. Seeing him staring intently at the sword, Shayu couldn't help but say with. Disgust, Master, does that sword look good with me? Why are you staring at it? Huh? Su Chonga's heart moved. Cow, cow, little eater of sword vinegar. He laughed and said, Well, I won't look at it, look at you. Saying that, Su Chonga turned his head and stared at her intently. Xiao Yu's cheeks turned red all of a sudden, like a flower blooming on her face, jeezy and blushed, lowered her head and said coquettishly, Lord, Master, did I force you to see it? 
Before Suchanga could speak, the mercy on the side suddenly laughed, you. Forced Gongzi, to see it. Seeing. The two sisters fighting, Suchanga shook his hand and smiled, and did not say anything more. Soon, the three arrived at the entrance of the black market. There have already been many monks here who have come to enter the black market, all anxiously hoping to enter the black market as soon as possible. Line up for Lao Tzu, otherwise no one will want to go in. What about you, you don't have long ears, do you? If you don't want to enter the black market, hurry up. At this time, one after another powerful figures were here to confirm the identities of these cultivators one by one, ordering them to line up, and some who refused to queue up were two big ear scrapers. Those people were slapped, did not dare to refute, and honestly lined up. The black market creator is extremely powerful and these powerful figures, raised by his subordinates, are all ruthless, who dares to provoke. Suddenly, the powerful figure suddenly saw Su Changa coming, and his eyes suddenly lit up, and he couldn't help but leave those cultivators in line, led people to do three steps and two steps forward, bent forward, and bowed, big brother. A big brother suddenly stunned many people. I'm Chow? Under what circumstances, the black market founder's subordinates actually nodded and bowed at that man? That's right, how powerful are these powerful figures, they would be willing to become someone else's little brother? I'm numb. Could it be that the man was a big man? A lot of people feel that they are blinded and look at this scene in disbelief. Under the attention of everyone, Suchanga coughed lightly and said, Loki. Ha. Huh. The. Powerful figure leader hurriedly nodded, yes. After that, the leader approached and said respectfully, Big brother, you. Don't have to queue up, go in first, in addition, you can stay in it for as. Long as you want, no limit on your time. Suchanga nodded. It is naturally impossible to queue up it is too wasteful of time. As for the unlimited time to enter, it is even more beautiful. As we all know, no matter who enters the black market, there is only one T. Time, and when the time comes, it will be teleported immediately. And he has no time limit, this wave is really special, the sense of superiority is really explosive. That's fine, open the door. Su Changa said lightly. The powerful figure immediately took out three black-robed cloaks and handed them over, and then waved his palm, and a portal suddenly opened and closed. Su Changa and Xiao Er put on black robes and walked in. With that, the portal closes. Read more novels for free on our website, tinyurl.com, slash, 2AA54Z8B. Countless cultivators lined up anxiously to watch them disappear into the portal, only feeling a deep sense of frustration. The same people, how can this treatment be so different? Alas, people are more angry than people. Worship the big guy. Su Changa took the two daughters, and after entering the black market, they soon came to the auction hall opened by the black dragon. At this time, the auction was in full swing. Suchanga pushed the door and entered, and at a glance, he saw that the black pressure in the field was full of heads, countless seats, all bidding hotly. And those people were fighting red faces. On the stage, the fox-eared woman worked hard to fan the atmosphere. As for the several boxes upstairs, there are also voices of continuous bidding, competing for lots. Three guest officers, I'm very sorry, you came late, there are no seats in. The venue. A waiter stepped forward and said with regret. Su Changa said lightly, I am a friend of the Black Dragon. Black Dragon? The waiter's heart was shocked. Someone actually called the owner by name? He suddenly guessed something, and his voice immediately changed extremely. 
respectfully, and asked, Dare to ask your excellency? That's right, I came last time, Su Changa whispered to him. Ah. It turned out to be you, the little one didn't recognize it just now. Please hurry up. The waiter smiled widely. When Su Changa came to the black market for the first time, it was this waiter who was helping to lead the way, and later after Su Changa finished the auction and left, the black dragon specially explained to him, and in the future, whenever Su Changa came, he immediately served with the highest standard of treatment. Su Changa looked upstairs and said, I want to sit in box one. The words came out. Before the waiter could speak, a low young man's voice suddenly came from the first box upstairs. I'm from the Dan Temple, and I hear your voice very young, boy, are you looking for death? As soon as the words fell, box two and box three suddenly made a gasp, shoo. It turned out that the person sitting in box number one turned out to be a person from the Dan Temple. Box number four also suddenly let out a cool sound, and said in shock, I gave up. Bidding for that thing just now, I don't want to provoke the damn god temple. The hall was also instantly on one side, and everyone's brains were shocked, and a terrified sound came from under the huge cloak. The damn god temple actually came to the black market, I will say how the no. One box was so rich and powerful just now throwing so much money to shoot. Things, it turned out to be an alchemist. Nima, I didn't expect that someone would dare to touch the head of the Dan. God Temple, there is a good show to watch now. I'll make a bet first, this new person will probably provoke a lot of people. Today, and the end will be worrying. You know, every alchemist should not be underestimated, the network behind it is intricate, there are one terrorist force after another, under normal circumstances, almost no one dares to touch the alchemist, let alone offend them. Because once they offend them, they will immediately use the network behind them to set fire to that person to death. In other words, offending an alchemist is equivalent to offending a large group. What's more, the person in box one was not an ordinary alchemist, but an alchemist from the Dan God Temple. Dan God Temple, a large force with extremely deep roots, the relationship. Network behind it is more complex than ordinary alchemists, and no one dares to mess with it. At the moment, everyone in the field, including the number two, number three, and number six box, Upstairs, all threw their divine consciousness over and swept it on Su. Changa. They all think that even if this person is crazy, he must have a degree. Right? Is the Dan Temple something that ordinary people can provoke? You. Actually compete with people for seats?